There are many kinds of vehicle and plant that can come into contact with power lines. If that happens, there may be no outward signs at all, but the potential of the vehicle will have risen to that of the conductors. In such circumstances, people working or passing close by are at risk of electrocution. Of course we can't, but if people could see the electrical potential, it might look like this. We can't see, feel or hear the danger until there is discharge to earth, and unfortunately that discharge can be through somebody who has not noticed the contact and then touches the machine. With the energized alert fitted, that strategic gap in our senses is covered. It monitors what it's connected to, and when it senses a rise in the electrical potential, it turns on the alarm. It does this with no connection to earth. That alarm alerts the operatives to the latent danger so that they can become part of the solution. This isn't a proximity sensor. Instead, it senses actual contact, and that is a strength because we are not replacing training and good preventative practice. The Energized Alert supplements prevention by saying to the operatives, an accident happened when the proximity zone was breached. That accident just became acutely life-threatening, so your next actions should be considered carefully. It can be fitted to a wide range of machinery or vehicles and records all incidents. The data collected can highlight retraining needs. Being Energized Alert has hidden benefits beyond the obvious because all events are recognized so they contribute to the professional learning process. Without these infrequent events being noticed, the opportunity for workers to gain vital experience is missed. Energized Alert highlights risks and by doing so encourages appropriate respect of the transmission infrastructure.